What's up guys? In this tutorial, I will show you how to reset your iPhone's camera settings back to default. If you're trying to reset your iPhone camera settings to the original factory defaults, there are two main ways to do it. One method allows you to manually adjust the settings back to default, while the other method involves resetting all settings on your iPhone, which affects more than just your camera. The easiest way to get your iPhone's camera settings back to the default is by manually adjusting them. This approach doesn't delete any data or affect other settings on your iPhone. And it's as simple as following along with the default settings on a new iPhone. Open the settings app on your iPhone. Now scroll down and tap on camera. This will take you to all the adjustable camera options on your iPhone. Once you're in the camera settings, you want to adjust them to match the default settings that typically come with an iPhone out of the box. Here are the key settings to reset. Tap on Formats and select High Efficiency. This is the standard setting for capturing photos and videos in the most space-efficient way, using Apple's format. For most users, the default is 1080p at 30fps. You can select this to match the default recording quality. Then, Record Slow-Mo. The default is 1080p at 120fps. Preserve Settings. By default, options such as Camera Mode, Creative controls and exposure adjustments are toggled off. This ensures your camera resets to standard settings every time you open it. Use volume up for burst. This setting is disabled by default. Scan a QR code. This setting is enabled by default. Show detected text. This setting is enabled by default. Grid slash level. Turning grid and level on or off depends on personal preference, but it's usually off by default. Mirror front camera. This setting is also off by default. View outside the frame. This setting is enabled by default. Prioritize faster shooting and lens correction. Both these settings are enabled by default on supported models. By manually adjusting these settings, you're essentially bringing your camera back to its original configuration. This is the most straightforward way to reset the camera without affecting other areas on your iPhone. If you prefer a more thorough reset, which doesn't just reset the camera settings, but also resets all the settings on your iPhone, there is another option. However, this will require you to reconnect Wi-Fi, Bluetooth devices and more afterward. Head to your settings, then scroll down and tap on General. Scroll down to the bottom and select Transfer or Reset iPhone. This option manages all reset functions and transfers for your device. In the next menu, tap on Reset, you will see a variety of reset options. Select Reset All Settings. When this is done, your iPhone will prompt you to confirm the action. This reset won't delete any personal data, such as photos, videos or apps, but it will wipe your Wi-Fi passwords, Bluetooth connections, wallpaper and other system settings. It's a good idea to back up your iPhone before doing this, just in case you need to restore something later. I hope this helped you out. Leave a comment if you have any questions and see you in the next one.